Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is TJ. Today's video is about how to install Oxygen OS like custom ROM in Redmi 5A. Other than Redmi 5A, you can install the same ROM in other devices also. I have added the list of devices you can use the same ROM in the description. This custom ROM is based on Oxygen OS and it runs on Android 11. Before installing, there are two things to keep in mind. First is, your phone's bootloader should be unlocked. And the second thing is, there should be some or the other custom recovery should be installed like TWRP or Orange Fox recovery. If you are a person who doesn't know what is custom recovery and what is flashing and how to unlock bootloader, kindly go google it. I'm not responsible for brick devices. Without wasting any time, let's get into the video. First of all, head into the Play Store app and search for an app called Device Hardware Info. Look for an app with this icon and install it and open it. Give those permissions and head into the system tab. Then look at the instruction set and note down whether your device is ARM device or ARM64 device or something else. This is useful at the time of downloading Google Apps because when it comes to custom ROM, most of the ROMs will not provide Google Apps along with that. We have to install it separately. Next step is to download the Google Apps. Here I am using my laptop for downloading but you can also use your smartphone to download. Search for open gaps and click on the first link. So there are four types of platform you have to choose ARM64 and the OS we are going to install is based on Android 11. So you have to choose Android 11 and there are so many variants of Google apps. You can choose accordingly. I'm going to install Pico only because I don't need anything more than Google Play Store and Google Play services. Other Google apps like Gmail, YouTube, Google Chrome and everything you can install it separately from the Play Store. So no need to worry. So click the download button and it starts downloading. Now head over to the ROM downloading page. I have given it in the description. This page is only for the devices Redmi 4A and 5A. Also I have given the website to download this ROM for other devices like Redmi 2 Prime, Lava, Raphael, Violet and etc. If you are wondering what are these names, these are the names of your device which is mostly of Xiaomi devices. If you are confused, you can go through my description. I have given the device name along with the model name. So you have to find out your device name and download the ROM accordingly. Okay, now let me download the ROM for Redmi 4A and 5A. Now head over to the download section and click on the link. There will be two to three versions of the ROMs available. You have to install the most recent one. In my case it is version 4.3, so I am downloading it. After downloading the custom ROM and the G apps, copy both the files to the internal storage of the phone. It should not be on any folders so that it will be easy for us to find out in the recovery. So next step is to install the custom ROM. Now follow my steps. First press the volume up button and power button for 4 to 5 seconds until you enter into the recovery mode. So in my phone I have installed the Orange Fox recovery but you can use TWRP recovery also. Now click wipe and select Dalvik system vendor data and cache. Please don't select internal memory because uh, the custom room and the G apps we have kept it in the internal memory will be deleted. And now swipe. It will wipe the selected partitions. Go back and go to the files section and install the wave OS file. Swipe to install. So this installation will take up to 2-3 to three minutes for full installation. So sit back and relax. 
So the installation is completed and next you have to wipe the cache and swipe. Go back and select the next file which is open gaps and swipe to install. Wait for some time. And the installation is completed. Now again wipe cache. Now simply click on reboot system. The first boot can take up to 3 to 4 minutes. So kindly wait. I'll just fast forward the video. So the device is booted up. I'll finish the setup and come back to you. So I have finished the initial setup and let me show you how the custom room looks like. Ok let's get into the settings. It says the model is Redmi 5A and the Android version is 11. As you can see the device is very faster now. Previously I was using MIUI which was lagging like anything. Since this OS is based on Oxygen OS I think this runs very fast. Ok let me get over to the display. They have this tap to wake feature. Pocket detection. Dark mode is there. You can enable it. You can customize your phone. Let me try some multitasking. It's somewhat good, it keeps it in memory. If you are a person who is having the device which is listed below and if you want to try something new other than your stock OS. You can try this OS for sure. It's very fluid. I even played some games in this. It's very fast. So that's it guys. If you have any doubts about this video, kindly comment it. If you want any other tech related videos, you can comment them too. Thanks for watching.